Good morning. Welcome to today. Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. We have Jacob and Brooklyn. They're our special guests. And Sophie. And we have Sophie, who is always our special special guest. Um, last night, Brooklyn and Jacob slept over, and now we're going to our their cousin's birthday party. But Brooklyn learned to do something last night at Nana's house. Let's show them. Come close. Wait chokers and bracelets. So she made these gorgeous chokers all herself. And then I made them um, bracelets right here. Bracelets? Will you, do you think you'll be giving those to anybody at the party? No. Nana braided her hair beautiful today. Yes. And she brushed baby, baby Jacob's hair all beautiful. Wait, you're not baby Jacob. Yeah, baby Jacob. You're not baby Jacob. How old are you? Four. <laughs> Four. That's not a baby. Last night we got out Gabby's old elastic thing, you know, with their loom. rainbow loom stuff, and they showed Brooklyn how to make her own stuff, jewelry, and she picked it up like a crazy girl. So that was super fun. But right now we are headed off to uh, Baby Jack's birthday party. If you guys are just tuning in now, Baby Jack is my third grandson. Anyways, we're headed over to his birthday party. Brooklyn helped me pick out his presents. I'm going to show you to them, show them to you really quick. You want to show them what we bought, Brooklyn? I got him some clothes. Oh, so we bought him. He's just started going to daycare now because he's one. And his mom, and his mom, right here. And I am, and I'm one like him. No, you're not one. You're not one. Why? Because how old are you? I don't know. You just told me how old you are. How old are you? <laughs> He's like a horse. He licks everything. You're four, silly. Oh, be careful. <laughs> okay, so we bought him a bunch of clothes for daycare. And Brooklyn made him this amazing story that she wrote all herself. The Lost Cat. It's called... The Lost Cat. It's called The Lost Cat. She drew pictures, she illustrated it, and she wrote the whole story. She finished it today. So, the end. So, she made that. And then we bought Jake, uh, we bought him this toy box that his mom wanted him to have. That's the kind she wanted, so we bought that. And then, Brooklyn picked out this cute chair that matches the toy box because we thought he would like a chair, right? Okay, we are off to the party, but before we get there, I want to give you one of my long-winded stories. <laughs> I've been getting a lot of people commenting saying that they've dreamed of Stella. And every time they tell me about their dream, they say things like she was just happily chomping grass or or running through a field. And the weird thing is, is I don't know what I thought before, but I thought animals kind of were like more like people when they died. But every time I've seen Stella or dreamed of Stella since she's been gone, she's just been hoarse. <laughs> Like literally, you can see that she's just relaxed and calm and happy, but she's just standing there looking at us like, yeah, we're all just standing here like hanging out, like what's next? Like exactly her personality, but even more calm. And so it's amazing to me that everybody who dreams her sees the same thing. Somebody told me today that they dreamed her and she was standing in a field chewing grass, chewing grass with one of her friends from her old farm. And what's beautiful about that is that we bought Stella, all her other friends at that farm went to the meat market. So all her other farm friends from that, her last home are gone. They are all in heaven. So that made me feel so happy. Like I, I believe that you guys. Jack, look, he got his chair already. Cause Brooklyn, hi, happy birthday party. Because Brooklyn's reading him the story that she made for him. And he's got this chair, and he's like, who are all these people? <laughs> there he goes. Look <laughs> how happy he is. He's just looking at you. He likes his new chair. It is cake time. Brooklyn's making Baby Jack a bracelet. So cute. Cake time, Jack.
No, you want to touch it? <laughs> Make a wish! Yay! Go to town! Go to town! Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Get in there. Yeah. Yeah, let him do it. Get in there. Yep, here it goes. <laughs> now eat it. <laughs> Try it. <laughs> yeah. Once he tries oh. it, he'll love it. Want cake? I'm like yes. scared of it. Is it because it's green? <laughs> oh. A blizzard, you guys. We are out in a blizzard. We're out in a blizzard because there's a lot of balloons. Yeah, we're out in a blizzard because there's a lot of balloons, Jacob said. See? The girls are bringing balloons home with them. Because we want, because we want to have a sleepover party. Mm-hmm. Yeah! So, so, Jacob and Brooklyn's mom and dad came to the party. And now we're here to the party. And now yeah. we're here to the party and then they went home and left the grandbabies here because we want to have a sleepover again, huh? We had so much fun last night. That's Sam doing all the work out there. It's freezing. I'm not worried about the drive. Are you guys worried about the drive? No. No, we're going to go home? What are we going to do when we go home? Play. Play. Play what? And, 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 play guns. Yeah, laser guns? Who's gonna take care of the horses? I am. You are? Yes, I am. Good. Are you gonna take care of the horses? I'm going to sell pink belly. <laughs> well, that was short lived. When you have to take care of the horses in cold weather, you get over taking care of the horses really fast. Our barn owner, though, she sent me pictures of our horses, all three of them, tucked inside the barn. Isn't that so nice? Like, whenever Ooh. it's bad weather, she puts them inside so they, be stay, so they stay warm and toasty. Lots of food, lots of hay, lots of shavings, keep all warm. That's so nice. Pray you guys, when we get home. We are back from the party and it's time to bring the girls in. No chores were done this morning, so we gotta quickly do that. Get some water, feed these little puppy ponies. Hey, hey Sky, hey Sky. You ready to come in? Just ready to come in. Look at that. Well, those are all covered in snow. They're all covered in snow. And then we gotta take all the snow off. Off you, get your kind of dry before you put your blanket on. Hey, Willow? She should have just kept her blanket on. No, I didn't think her blanket was on this morning. Gracie's got snow all over you. Yeah, you have snow all over you, Gracie. I mostly brushed Gracie off. They all brushed off? Ready for bed? I need a hoof pick. You need a hoof pick? Also, we also huff pick at night, especially when they're out in the snow because they get all this snow build up into their feet, their hooves. So we huff pick. Where's the huff pick? Mm -hmm. huff pick? One huff pick. And then we'll put Willow's blanket on. Right now I'm chopping ice. This is the aftermath of leaving the buckets in the stall. They get frozen. So what I usually do is I get two new buckets, put water in them, and and put them in the stall. 
Got the water, red water buckets for her today. And I'll thaw these out. We use these buckets for Willow and Gracie, so I'm gonna have to chop the ice as best I can. Dump all this off in the water trough, which is heated water, and fill them back up. And that's what you gotta do when it's minus 22 degrees out. You can see my breath. Or I could use heated water buckets. I did have, I have two heated water buckets that I may use if it gets any colder, but it should be warming up soon. So we should be fine with that. Still some snow and I don't want her to be wet underneath her blanket. That's right, that's why we're brushing her. She's not just wet underneath her blanket. Look at that brush, it's all full of snow. Kind of I might need a curry comb or something. We're getting you all clean there, Gracie. We're getting you all dried off. Yeah, I like the camera, don't you? I'll be back. I need. Okay, look at all that snow on her. Yeah, for snow, I suggest a magic brush. Why do they sit and out in the off. snow? Why do they sit out in the snow? I don't know. Why are you guys sitting on the snow and you got a big shelter here? Look at all that snow coming in. Closing the door is a tricky feat. And there's Hendrix. What are you doing, Hendrix? Looking for food? Grab these buckets for the morning. Hey Hendrix, catching mice. Hendrix, you got lots of food there. More food. There go Willow. Put your blankie on. Put your blankie all on. Put your blankie all on, Willow. Look at the heart. Hey, Alright, see you later. later. Hello. Bye, Willow. Stay warm. I don't think she knows that she has Bye, Gracie. Oh. Bye, Gracie. See you in the morning. See you in the morning. See you later, Sky. I know. See you in the morning. Look at your face is all wet. Our house is such a mess. But my heart is so happy, you guys. I love having the kids here. I miss having little kids at home. Gabby's at Kaylee's house. We are playing. What are we playing? She'll like. She'll like. She'll like. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. So I got this stand and it is going to be for Sophie. I'm, it's for my Kia. I'm going to get another one for Gabby. I absolutely love it. I didn't know if I was going to love it. I like that it's flat on the top and she can put stuff on top of it. She has all of her briars. Are these all the briar that you have? Yeah, and then Gabby has a bunch. They're separated now. And then we have uh, custom Stella. Somebody made that for us. It was so kind. Anyway, these are all her Schleich, all Sophie Schleich, these ones. And these ones. And then whatever ones they're playing with. Who's playing with those? Me. Oh, is that where they go? Yeah. <laughs> and we got some over here. Witch. Do you, they're trapped by an evil witch? Yeah, Jacob's an evil witch. That's Jacob, are you an evil witch? Yeah, because because I have an evil witch. I evil witch stick. You have an evil witch stick? A devil witch. I mean, a devil stick. Oh, a devil <laughs> stick. Got it. Uh, Get, ow! Gab, Sophie, I think, has more schleich, and then Gabby has more fences and more jumping and, and jumping really jumps and stuff. In this bucket, she has all her saddles and all her food and her feeding pans and baby bottles and all the little stuff. Over here, she's got all her jumps and her wash station and extra stalls. And over here, she's got all her people and blankets. Hope you guys had an amazing, awesome weekend, and we'll see you guys next time. Bye.